people could sit on their front porch, I would drive past, stay in my car or just stand on the sidewalk and take pictures of their families there. That way it was just something for them to do to get out of the house, something to give back to the community. It was really a lot of fun. Some kids came out in superhero costumes. We had Spider-Man and Thor, and we had a lot of people with toilet paper sitting on their porches. One family had a toilet paper fight. A lot of people were out with their dogs just sitting on the porch, and it was just really nice because people had something to get dressed up for and, and look forward to rather than just being stuck in the house all day. And it seemed to make everyone smile, it seemed to make everyone happy. Nikki emailed me and said, hey, we're getting married on the sidewalk. Would you mind doing that? And I was like, yeah, of course. Just thought, you know, if she's gonna do it and we can do it and be safe and not break any rules, then we can stay on the sidewalk and shoot from a distance. Typically, we can get a lot closer than what we did today. So it's just very different, very different to shoot because usually you're looking for responses and groups and people interacting with each other, but now there's, there's no interaction because everyone's far away. It made me feel like I was doing something, it was something I could do to give back, something I could do just to make other people smile. But it was just really nice that people wanted this. And I think in 30, 40 years, people will look back and talk about their, their quarantine and COVID, just like we talk about other big events. The difference is we've all captured it and we all have these memories and these moments. Um, so I think it's gonna be really special to them. Mm -hmm.